This video was disseminated on behalf of Light AI Inc. The video contains forward-looking statements that are based on current assumptions and subject to risks and uncertainties. There is no guarantee of future results. I want you to try something. Pull out your smartphone, look at it for a second. Think about what this tiny device can do. It can guide you through traffic in real time, recognize your face in milliseconds, translate dozens of languages instantly. Now here's the crazy part relating to illness. When you get strep throat, your doctor still does what they did in the 1950s. They stick a wooden paddle in your mouth, shine a flashlight down your throat, and then they're required to take a swab and send it to a lab to be cultured. Some lower middle income countries don't even have lab infrastructure to confirm group A infection and will make a clinical call to treat or not by a visual exam but the gold standard is to culture the patient. And guess what? That is wrong 70% of the time. That's why doctors prescribe antibiotics for six out of the 10 sore throats, even though only two or three actually need them. This isn't just wasteful, it's dangerous. Antibiotic resistance is now one of the World Health Organization's top five global health threats. But what if I told you this is about to change? Imagine screening and testing for strep throat with your smartphone. No doctors, no wooden paddles, just your phone, a photo, and an answer in seconds. And what if strep throat is just the beginning? Meet Peter Whitehead from Light AI. He's not your typical medical innovator. He's an entrepreneur who solves the obvious problems that everyone else ignores. His last invention, a dental imaging device called the Velloscope. It's been used in over 50 million oral exams by over 10,000 dental practitioners worldwide. Now he's done it again. And this time the market is exponentially bigger. Peter and his team spent eight years building something revolutionary, an AI system that aims to identify strep throat from a smartphone photo with accuracy. Think about what that means. No more unnecessary doctor visits, no more guesswork, no more wasted antibiotics. Just snap a photo, and you could have an additional health insight to guide your decision. Introducing Light AI, ticker symbol Algo, his latest brainchild. And what it offers isn't just faster findings, it's a revolution in how we approach infectious diseases. Light AI's developing technology aims to transform any smartphone into a testing powerhouse. Here's how it works. You open the app, follow a few simple steps, and snap a photo of the throat. Within seconds, the AI analyzes the image, providing a finding. No swabs, no labs, no waiting. Just AI-assisted health insights, pending regulatory approval. And the potential is staggering. There's unmatched accuracy. Light AI's platform is backed by a proprietary library of over 300,000 images, delivering a negative predictive value, an NPV, of 100% in a pre-FDA study. Global scalability, no hardware needed, just a smartphone. This means that tech can scale rapidly, especially in underserved markets. Third, time-saving efficiency. You can get a result in under a minute, compared to hours or even days with traditional methods. But what makes Light AI truly unique is its scalability. Through a partnership with TC4A, Tech Care for All, the company's poised to bring its tech to lower income countries addressing some of the world's most pressing public health challenges. Here's where it gets really interesting. Most medical device companies have one path to market, the long, expensive FDA approval process. But Peter's company has three. First, they can go direct to consumer. No FDA approval needed, launch the app and let people screen themselves. Second, They've partnered with a global healthcare platform that reaches 120,000 practitioners in emerging markets. Places where quality healthcare is limited, but smartphones are everywhere. And third, they are pursuing FDA approval with clinical trials already designed in partnership with Carillon Health, a division of Elevance Health. If successfully executed, these paths could open significant market opportunities for Light AI. And they're not doing it alone. The former chief strategy officer of Bristol Myers Squibb just joined the board. 
The company's chief operating officer, Thomas Skarnecchia, is also the former vice president, Office of Technology Evaluation, and chief information officer for health giant Johnson & Johnson. That's where he established a research unit to evaluate and introduce new technologies into the Johnson & Johnson Pharmaceutical Group research and development. Light AI also just appointed Silicon Valley leader Anthony Schaller as president and CTO, with plans to launch their wellness app for strep A detection on iOS and Android in the third quarter of 2025. He'll leverage his extensive experience in tech partnerships and development to advance their AI-powered healthcare solution. And they've secured patents across multiple jurisdictions. What's most fascinating is this. While tech giants are busy counting steps and measuring sleep, this tiny company wants to turn every smartphone on earth into a detection and testing device. And strep throat? That's just the beginning. 600 million people get strep throat every year. The world needs billions in new solutions just to fight antibiotic resistance. Light AI is developing tech that aims to assist in addressing both of these challenges. And it's public under the ticker ALGO on the Canadian markets, OHCFF on the US OTC, and 0HC on the Frankfurt Stock Exchange. Let's be clear, Light AI is not without risks. Big tech will eventually figure out that smartphones can do real health testing, not just wellness tracking. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, the like button, and follow along for our next video.